confidence is walking into the unknown with curiosity and wonder. And with that, welcome, Bear Towns people, to Iron Mind Metal Monday. Count your blessings entitled Blessed Beyond Measure. Some exciting things going on in the Wellspring season. But before we get into that, subscribe to the Iron Mind Metal Monday email if you've not done so already in the description below. Give this video a like and let's delve into it, shall we? Without further ado. <laughs> Why am I feeling blessed beyond measure? And quite frankly, wherever you are, no matter what is going on in your life, why I would encourage you to feel blessed beyond measure. Let's first start with the word blessed, which a lot of people are going to look at potentially with some religious connotation, and they might actually kind of contort and recoil. They might have an aversion to it. So we're going to approach it from very, very pragmatic and practical standpoint, which is that our minds are very much computers. They have an operating system. The words we speak, the thoughts we think, the past experiences we have had create our operating system and the scripts, our self-talk, the spoken word is incredibly important. So if we focus on a sense of lack, if we focus on everything that's going wrong in the world, one, that is playing into our just essentially default programming, which is to be fear-based, to be in our amygdala, to be on high alert, to have anxiety around that. And not that, you know, we, we shouldn't be aware of those things, but if that's what we're consistently focused on, we're not going to be very fulfilled or happy as human beings. So if we can look at saying blessed beyond measure. I have more than enough. I'm speaking that into my life. Even if that is not currently the case, what it's going to allow you to do is over time through repetition, change that subconscious programming, rewrite the script and create a new paradigm of thought. And what you will be doing is looking for the little blessings in your life. I live in Canada and just to be very, very frank, I am blessed beyond measure to have even been born in this country. I essentially got the genetic lottery. I think I know there's a lot of other phenomenal places to live on this planet. I'm very thankful I live in this country. I have free healthcare. I have a beautiful landscape. I have education. I have incredible food and nutrition available to me. One of the things that I've actually been very, very thankful and blessed to have in my life is sports supplements. I'm currently doing some very physical work. I'm also doing quite a lot of creative work and, and really looking to progress and expand my physical fitness and having access to super, super high quality supplements that allow me to function and feel my best is a huge blessing. I, I feel incredibly blessed beyond measure. I've been having time to go for walks and talk to my amazing friends and to build new connections and to have those people in my life it makes me feel like I am blessed beyond measure. And something that I also feel incredibly blessed beyond measure about is just this wellspring season, season, this kind of second one around the sun that I've been focusing and creating towards. And the fact that being well spoken during this well spring to be able to express myself through eloquent, elegant words and to stream together coherence of sentences is something that I feel very, very blessed for. It's a skill that I've been practicing and working on cultivating. However, being well spoken is just something that I think is amazing and something that the more we can aspire to express ourselves in in a very concise and a coherent fashion, the more we can take what we're feeling inside and translate that into words, the more clarity we're going to have, the more we're going to be able to create. And the more I think we're going to be able to fully embrace this wellspring season, the season of curiosity, of awe, of wonder, of creative and infinite possibilities. So to all of those of you in the Global Iron Mind Village who invest their time to watch each week, thank you with a depth of gratitude drawn from the well of my heart. Your collaboration is of absolute imperative to 
further the envisage of Iron Mind, which is to forge a modern Renaissance mind, a mind that is creative, resilient, and therefore adaptable. If you could like, comment, share, and subscribe to APs, the almighty algorithm gods, that their thirst for your attention and potentially your future unborn children might be slaked, I would be ever so delighted. And until next week, my friends, bless up and our jewel, Parabellus.